Hey everyone, this is Will from Going Awesome Places. And Arian from See You Soon Travel. Tonight we're teaming up with Tourism Toronto to experience Nuit Blanche. Started in 2006, Nuit Blanche is an all-night arts festival that runs from dusk until dawn and gives you the chance to experience contemporary art in a fun, engaging and interactive way. Whether it's your first time or you've been here before, Nuit Blanche can be a little bit intimidating, but it doesn't have to be. So to make sure you have a great time, here are our top tips for how to experience Nuit Blanche. Well, our first tip is to plan your night. Nuit Blanche is spread out across Toronto. It takes up a lot of space. So you wanna plan what you wanna see before you head out. Hop to one of the event centers. Nathan Phillips Square is a great place to start because here's where you can pick up a map to see where all of the installations are within the city. You can also talk to volunteers to get their tips and recommendations before you set out for the night. Tip number two is all about timing. And so from the festival opening at 7 p.m. to midnight, you're dealing with all these crowds, which means that there's gonna be lines and you're gonna have to be a lot more patient. But if you're willing to stay out late, I highly recommend that you come out past midnight because that's when you'll be able to see some of the big exhibits with a lot less crowds. Tip number three is to get interactive. Many of the installations were designed for you to be a part of them, to get interactive with them. So don't be shy, get right in there, experience them through all five of your senses to really get the full impact of what the artist's intentions were. So tip number four, take public transit. Getting around by car is tricky because they close off many of the roads and the installations are spread across the entire city. So we recommend picking up a TTC day pass. A single pass is good for up to two adults and four children and allows you to use the TTC until Nuit Blanche finishes. If you're coming from outside the downtown core, you can park for free at many station lots. Plus, using public transit will allow you to get off your feet and visit as many installations across the city as possible. And our final tip is to take a break and recharge. There's a lot of walking involved when you're out for Nuit Blanche, so you gotta take a moment or two to relax. The great thing is, is that there are a number of food spots around the city that stay open late during Nuit Blanche. You'll also find a number of food trucks around some of the installations. So it's great to fill up on some food, grab a cup of coffee, warm up, so that you're rested to keep going all night long. So those are our tips for getting the most out of your Nuit Blanche experience. We hope that you've enjoyed them. And of course, if you need more information, be sure to check out ctorontonow.com. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.